Swirl around for about 10 seconds and you're done. That's, okay. you gotta swirl. Ugh, I'm not feeling very good. I woke up and I was like, man, the lighting's terrible in here. I woke up this morning and I was just like, everything was aching and I was just, ugh, in a total, in a total slump. Anyway, so in that moment, I decided, man, our room is messy. I had an idea. I'm just going to sell my chair. You know, you like that um, I don't make a chair that I had from Secret Lab. I just sold it because I was sweating so freaking much, right? And we don't have AC in this house, but we do, but it's, it's in the bedroom instead. It was just super hot and leather. It looked good, the chair was great, but it was just way too freaking hot. So I just sold that. I bought it for $3.59, sold it for $2.80. Not a bad price considering most furniture depreciates way more than that, but there was nothing else like that chair on the Craigslist market. And so I just sold it for $2.80. Now I'm buying a smudge desk chair. That was $208 after taxes, so I just picked that up. So that'll be here in a couple weeks. Actually, a week. It's kind of hard to figure out where to look. Do you look here? Do you look there? Where's the camera on here? So I should be looking right there. Hey guys, it's kind of hard to get tested for COVID actually because here in California, you have to get referred by a doctor and then you gotta go take your test. And CVS normally does COVID testing in drive-thrus, but they don't have any available times in any of their locations for like the next three days. So here I am, I ha like, I ha like I had to leave work early today because I was like, hey, I don't feel super good. I'm gonna get tested. And now they're like, well, uh, we may need you to give us that test result so we can even let you come back to work. My hair looks weird, but I won't be able to get it tested. So I might be able to work for a couple days. I've been watching a lot of Potato Jet lately. And now he is by far my favorite YouTuber. Man, look at my posture. I'm like all slumped over. <laughs> working out. Actually, I haven't been working out that much at all lately. I would always say that I would love to meet Peter McKinnon, but I would rather hang out with Gene, Carrie, and Sam. They just seem like way more fun. <laughs> no offense against Peter or Maddie or any of this crew, but they just seem like a lot more fun. Because Gene is always like, like, you know how he starts his videos? <laughs> hey guys. He's always laughing at something. It's so funny. It's so funny. I'm using my phone to record these vlogs because I don't want to exert the energy to hold up that big a camera. And it has, a, it has a 24 millimeter lens anyway. I don't have a 16. Or I do, but it's for a cropped sensor. So look at all that noise. Yeesh. Man, I look super fat. Well, I guess this is a good time to do some online shopping. I thought I'd save money during COVID. <laughs> I'm on my way to go get my COVID test. Um, so, so far the aches and pains have gone away. Um, I still have a loss of appetite. I can't really, like I don't have, I really want to eat anything. Um, I have not lost my sense of taste or smell, but my headache has gotten a lot worse. My headache has gotten a lot worse. They just described to me what the test is and they gotta stick something up your nose, like really far up there. I do have to tickle your brain a little bit. Um, is well, that, that's what wait, it feels wait, like. do you mean like, do you mean like physically or is that like hypothetically? Whirl around for about 10 seconds and you're done. That's, okay. you gotta swirl. Oh, so wow, okay. things going in my nose? Yeah. Golly. All right. Try not to fight. Gotta go back and tell me. Okay, there you go. Oh, God. Ah. <laughs> thank welcome. you so much for what you guys do and for risking yourselves out here. This is no a big worries. deal, so thank you You're very welcome. much, okay? Bye bye. I had to fight that so bad. It's just the most unnatural feeling ever. This is actually not a bad angle right here. Like, I've got this. So, right now it's on the side of the seat right here. I just think it's gonna fall over if I hit the speed bump. Let's try it. Let's try and see. Oh, yep, yeah, there it goes. You guys like my chair? It's my new gaming chair. This thing was $400, the most ergonomic chair you could find. Yes. All right, go back to editing. Yeah, it's her chair. <laughs> and boom. Whenever I'm editing, this is just where Enzo lives. Hey, buddy. Hi. That's his toy. He always wants to play with his toy. Every time I go to play with him or I just scratch him, he immediately goes and grabs his toy. See, watch this. Enzo, come here. Come on. <gasps> hey. <laughs> See, I just start playing with him and <laughs> where does he go? He's just gonna go get his toy. That's it. He doesn't want to play unless it's with his toy. That's it. He's like, all right, now we're in business. <laughs> he is vicious with this thing. And this probably goes without saying, but these vlogs are probably gonna have close to zero production quality. Mainly because I'm lazy. And, and really because I can't ever really see myself. And when I tried these before, I didn't like how they looked because I didn't like the way I was positioning the camera, or maybe the lighting was bad, or the microphone wasn't on, or I had to plug into the headphone jack, or other stupid things like that. I'm curious to see what kind of computer resources rendering the audio uses in Media Encoder. So right now we're rendering 45 minutes worth of audio in this 45 minute interview that I did. And obviously it renders audio first right here. Doesn't even know how long it's gonna take yet, but the screen is super warm, it's hot. And currently it just says we're using a lot of power 
Um, we're using a lot of the disk you know, because it has, a, it has to write to the files, it has to write to a file over here. And there's none of the GPU whatsoever because there's nothing graphically being processed. It's all auditorial, if that's even a word. Almost none of the processor and a good chunk of the memory, but not that much. Um, my temperature is down here running at about 60 degrees Celsius is then the yellow and then in the gray over here is the percentage of usage. And this is average across all uh, 16 cores. Oh, 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 okay, so see here. So it just started rendering the video portion. So we've got 80% CPU usage, 65% memory usage, very high for both programs because it's using Premiere Pro and Adobe Media Encoder. Usage is kind of evenly split, mostly in Adobe Media Encoder, but it is using half of the net percentage with Premiere Pro as well too. Our temperatures are still only down at 70, it's, so it's, it, it's in between like 75 and 60, which is pretty good because I have this ginormous cooler on here. This thing is insane, but it's not even hot. Like I can touch it, it's fine. Eee, I'm so excited. I ordered a deep dish pizza from downtown and I've been waiting like two hours to get it. And so, where's the pizza? Where's the pizza? You, oh, you just see like these bug eyes coming after you at light speed. <laughs> yeah, that's, oh my gosh, this thing is heavy. Oh my goodness. That looks bomb. Huh? Oh man, this pizza is really good. Link in the description for these guys in San Diego. Oh, so good. You guys did a really good job. Well, tomorrow's the big day. I figure out whether or not I have COVID-19. So until then, I'm just gonna keep watching Potato Jet. So let's cut to tomorrow. Hello? Hi, do you speak with Nicholas Corbett? You do not have COVID. Bye-bye. Yeet! We're so happy that I do not have this pandemic. Cause now we can bang. Oh, I don't have COVID-19, that's a plus. All right, we're just, <laughs> yeah, she was like, Bieber, weren't you super, you were like super excited, right? Yeah. Yeah, she was like, yes, I got to go do stuff. I don't Yay. Get to, I don't get to still get to the house. So yeah, I know. She was like, I can't stay in the house for two weeks. That's ridiculous. I don't know one time I, that I got stuck inside the house for like two weeks. No. I was like an emotional wreck. Oh yeah, you were, it was pretty bad. Yeah. You're like, what's wrong? <laughs> <laughs> All right, I think I'm gonna end the vlog here. Oh yeah, thank goodness I don't have COVID. Enzo, aren't you excited that I don't have COVID-19?